All right, all right. So let's see what happens in this box break. The graded notes. Where everybody gets three years in. We're going to do some randoming right now. Seven times two for the owner names. Seven times two for the years. And we'll stack those lists up side by side. And that's how you get your years. So here we go. Lucky number seven. The first list is done. Seven times, let's hit a big item. Lucky number seven. So I'm going to try to put that in a little different so it looks better. All right. So, yeah, you can see your years right here. Three years right there. 68, 69, 70. Is this you don't see five dollar bills like that anymore that is a 1995 graded dollar nineteen ninety five is the year and so a big congratulations is in order For Tanner W, who's, who has 1995. Congratulations to Tanner. This has a special 1985-K with row Ruben. So that's a reference to this here. You can see Ruben's signature. You can see the K right there. You can see the other person's name right here, the other signer. Withrow and then Reuben. So, this is very important that it says Dallas. This comes from Dallas. 
that alone might make it be the rare dollar to have is the fact that it is a K from Dallas. So anyway, really neat. You don't see these $5 bills much anymore. That style of five. Really cool. Congrats, Tanner. I hope it has some big values. As a matter of fact, I always like to go check on this because I don't, I don't know the values right away. Sometimes it's easy to look these up on eBay. But you can look right here and see if yours checks out. It does not. I do not see yours listed on the top notes in the product. But I'm sure it still has some good value to it as far as value goes.